Good morning, guys. Welcome back to our United Kingdom uh, campaign. Where, uh, yes, we are in turn 100. I did uh, a few turns in uh, organizing a bit the economy, and I did manage to play around with it. So I have quite a lot of buildings and uh, units trained. Uh, we are potentially making a bit of cash, but. The thing is, I still have a lot of troops in the fort, mainly here at Fonosterain. I did not move them out. And Athelin, I do have a general, but this is not the general that's from any other place, like moves from Bairi. This guy is still here. This is actually a general that I got maybe two turns after... Maybe like two or three turns after uh, I ended the previous episode. Uh, I believe it was like turn 92 or 93. And yeah, he was pretty decent, skilled bureaucrat. He has protector of Athelin apparently, command renowned, smart, deserved. So Ori, I think, yeah, Ori had to do a bit of defense with him from Angmar. And Halbarad yes. is actually moving towards Novcha. You may notice that the Novcha are um, recruiting. Now, in terms of buildings, I did manage to push for the farms, the chicken farming to get that growth up. And you know what? Best if we go quickly through what I have. Free roast, I have the land clearance, leather tanner, library, like basically the starters. So the growth is there. Uh, I am gonna leave it on normal, it's fine, I do have proper tower, so it's not exactly a rush to upgrade it. I only have the Carpenter's Hut, now maybe I'll change later on for the farms, we'll see. Barry, uh, again, the same farms, Leather Tanner, Library, and I'm actually going for the War Camp. I already moved in the meantime, Nalchi Militia. I can move the General out of Barry, actually, because... It's gonna be like around 70%. And in two turns, I'll get five more percent. That's gonna be 75. And of course, maybe the culture as well is gonna go through. I might actually keep him a bit more longer into Barry just to make sure it doesn't suddenly drop to 65 because there is a growth happening here. And that can offset a bit the public order. Deadman's Dyke, again, managed to get the land clearance. Uh, Roads, finally, I'm gonna have, have it finished next turn. Leather Tanner is gonna be next, it's gonna be remain like that. I'm gonna come back to Phonos Terrain in this area in just a bit because let's say something interesting happened in, happened in this area. Gob Drain, the same, I believe only the library I managed to build. It's fine, meth rate. I've been uh, going in and out with the uh, troops to train here, so that's why it's a bit of a queue for the Wardens. Now, in terms of the troops, you may notice that I'm not gonna invest, gonna, not, I'm just gonna start not investing into Brilliant Militia, Archer Militia to have in my armies. I'm gonna try to give it for Rangers, Wardens. I do have quite a bit of stacks of those guys. And I believe Methrate. Maybe the grain exchange, sheep farming. I can't remember if I managed to stick something here. Artilin managed to have the library only needed, uh, and it's fine with this general. Start bad. We have got the tunnel line clearance. Uh, next turn, the royal guard is gonna finish, so that's gonna be nice. Also, the same, the basics. Uh, nothing yet. More units trained that are in the fort. I'm gonna need to move them out, except the militia. Seloniak, we have the rangers. Next turn, I'm gonna move these guys out. Tirthine, by the time the herbalist is gonna finish, I'm gonna have enough population to upgrade it. So that's gonna be perfect. Um, yeah, because it's like 11. 2%, I think it's like 22 per turn or something like that. Or either by the time Herbalist finishes, or it's gonna remain like one turn or something like that. Uh, I have enough operation to finally upgrade Tirthine. 
And now North Shaw. Again, managed to get uh, chicken farming, communal farming, and the war camp. They decided to invest into war camp mainly just to have some extra troops, like to train if need be. And I am training some scouts and retrain what I had lost here. So that's that's perfect. Uh, Marcia militia and the uh, Brilliant militia is gonna retrain this turn, so they're gonna be full strength. So that's why I kind of pushed for farms to have the growth really quick, to have proper toss. I can move troops out and con conquer more. And of course, the war camp, which actually swapped around who has free upkeep. And apparently the, the wardens, I pay the most upkeep for the wardens. If the game says so, the game says so. Also in a deal though, I kind of did not read correctly i don't have the war camp but unfortunately i'm on, i'm only getting clan spearman so that was 1500 investment that i could have invested in something else i'm hoping uh, the next upgrade of the war camp i get my own units at least i should be getting my own units and then Fenas Drunin, uh, enough to train the bodyguards, a new general out here, plus more of the battle troops available. Some of the troops, I have them here into the fort, I just uh, moved them, I kind of done everything for this turn as well. And I'm saying kind of, again I'm gonna get back to it after we gone through the settlements. So I have some let's say mid-tier militia to mid-tier in the fort and the rest i'm keeping them here because i might have the more better troops maybe finally go push towards moria or even dunland at least take uh, their capital for example and that way only only moria can besiege austin the deal because technically I won't be bordering Dunland directly, only and directly to here, which I don't think they're gonna attack. And again, in the same terms uh, of buildings, uh, Brynost managed to get only the chicken farming for now. I'm trying to. Uh, this could have been the investment for the war camp at uh, Deal could have been for Brynost for the farms. More of a tart. again, soon I'm gonna have the war camp finished, which gives me the units that I have in the other areas as well, which means I'll finally be able to retrain some of these guys, perfect. Uh, apparently I forgot to kill the sheep farming, but irrelevant. And Comet Green, the same, managed to get some of the chicken farming, land clearance, all that leather tanner for now to have a bit more growth, and of course, finally, I had the wooden hunter available to chain. So that's about it. Now, one other major event that happened during these turns was that Kazadum actually became a horde. So I'm assuming, since Moria took Moria proper, goblins took Moria proper, uh, looks like they took Erui and they took uh, Fenholm as well. So basically, goblins of Moria are having a really good game. Oh, and now I see that actually they took Burn Soul as well. All right. Also, yes, in the meantime, this diplomat finally in two turns they can reach Airborne and see maybe I can squeeze some cash from them and all that. Other than that, uh, looks like Mangalen is uh, back in rebel hands. So I'm kind of thinking maybe have this general as well to uh, have him for Mangalen because. If Bree can hold it, maybe I can hold it. Would be tough because we'll have better whites spawning like every turn or so. And uh, only now I noticed because I kind of wanted to continue a bit with the management, or at least I was thinking, okay, travel 100, maybe it's time to move out. I'm gonna go into negative once I start moving troops out of this fort. Mainly. I was seeing like, oh, okay, Barry is gonna get attacked from this Golden unit from the south, blah, blah, blah. And I noticed something at the borders. 
they look a bit blue. And if you look at the Numinas, the doors has it. Now, since it's a bit hard to see the border here, I don't really have towers over here. I have this one from Barry, but it's only barely seeing the border. I was uh, not really paying attention, only when I saw the unit over here, or like I said, I'm gonna get attacked from the south, and all I saw, like, hold up, the border is a bit different color. So not sure when Anuminas was taken, and I kind of don't want to exterminate it, so to speak. And uh, I don't think it's been taken since like maybe one or two turns after I've started doing the management. Mainly because of a couple of things. You can see the, de the damage on the walls. So this makes me assume that it was actually at the start of this turn or like the end of previous turn, they took Anuminas. Which means if I can take it in under five turns, I don't need to exterminate, which will help because I don't need to upgrade on Minas as fast as possible. Because if I take a Numinas, then I'll be bordering an advice from here, from Michelle Delving, and they can, they can uh, attack a Numinas, and of course I'll have the dwarves. Maybe they'll decide to attack, or maybe not. I don't know. And that's the thing that makes me think that actually it's been taken recently. Maybe even, like I said, the past turn. Uh, clues being the walls just being damaged. They might have been damaged from previous fights. But usually it's like around 20% the first siege. Usually if you just take in the settlement, it's like around here, the damage for the walls. And another clue that might show that it was just recently taken is the culture. The Dormant culture is not really high up. Yes, we have the middlemen from Bree because they held Anuminas for quite a while. But that means the dwarf, Dwarves just took Anuminas because they don't have a high culture in there. Which means... I don't know exactly what they have there though. So they might have elites. And my plan would be have this general from Barry, he's gonna be the general to keep an eye on Illuminas for the rest of the game. But I'm thinking orders, my lord. these guys are gonna move out. And I can reach yes, it actually. It's like two turns from uh Deadman's Dyke. Problem is I do need to come with these guys. Which it's like three turns. If I start moving them now, by the time I can siege Anuminas or do the siege, these guys from here can arrive and merge up if need be. Unfortunately, I don't think. Okay, let's say one turn. If I move them now, two turns, three, and then from here, four, five, yeah. So unfortunately the rangers and these guys can't reach uh, it's only the wardens and maybe the rangers that it's a bit annoying that i don't have them but i do have these guys that are more elite and i was about to say oh i can actually get some mercenaries but with what cash so i'm thinking i'm gonna start moving now with everybody that is I'm gonna take these guys out of the fort as well. And you know what? We actually can march up. And then, yeah, looks like it's one, two, three, four turns. Yes, my lord. And I'm gonna have Eldarian. Your orders, my lord. I'll rip off your head and spit down your neck. Yes, my lord. I'm only here to fight the Yaga loot. How many actually have four, four, eight? Eight with another seven, fifteen, Orders. nineteen with these guys. 
20 with this general. You know what? I'm gonna risk it. Oh, actually, you could have moved more yes, than that. Nice. Making camp here. Uh, 70 percent, two turns should be fine, hopefully. Uh, and then from here, my lord. Your will, my lord. My lord. Yes, my lord. Can we actually merge? How many turns would this be? Three turns, actually. Yes, my lord. My lord. But they do have. Like a big garrison. Right, you know what? I'm just gonna move them out. This and throw it out there. Over the land. Get some cell swords, Lord, maybe? What other building I have? Oh, I have the herbalist. Maybe. Don't invest in that one, and I think, of course, some uh, recruitment. And that means Dyke is happy as it is. Movement speed is gonna be a bit more faster once I have the roads finished, yes, so sure. Your orders, my lord. With honor, my lord. Yes, my lord. Your orders, my lord. Okay, uh, if uh, there's any. Yes, my lord. I can actually. My lord. Your will, my lord. Uh, you know what? The calf. I can actually leave. Orders. Inside the fort for now. Your orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. Yes. The same here. So. To save a bit of cash, they can uh catch up. And uh, yeah, once the roads are finished, these guys can get there basically in three turns anyway. Uh, because it's gonna be three turns regardless. Once I put yes, it under siege lord. and these guys merge, they literally have enough movement speed to just merge up. Your orders, my lord. Uh, okay, I'm gonna leave it like this for these ones. I do have a lot of calf, which might be clutch to be honest. I'm fighting, fighting dwarves. Which they don't have cav at all, and having cav cavalry superiority, especially with yes, archers as well, might really tip the balance. Even if I am with these guys, they can just, I don't know, try to hold the line as much as possible, sacrifice all the melee units, and just have a bunch of cav charges going in and out. Yes, my lord. Uh, unfortunately, this continue. guy is gonna be behind as well. Orders, my yes, my hopefully, lord. with the roads, he's gonna move a bit more faster. But basically, orders, this yes, general and then orders. these guys are gonna have to merge up. Now, the doors might actually decide to move troops out. You never know. So, it could be a bit more easier battle. But I really want Aluminas, and hopefully, the population grew. Quite a bit under Breeze control. So I can just occupy and definitely try to push for the upgrade as soon as possible. That's gonna be priority. So I have proper walls and whatnot. Right. But I think that's pretty much it. I'll have Whoa, Albarad going to Novcha. Train some of the they train some of these guys out here. Reorganize the army a bit. Yes, yes, my lord. And probably, yeah, I'll have a selling out these guys as well to move. Sure. My lord. I'm probably thinking make the best army I can make with these guys, and then they have the rest come as reinforcements. Yes. Uh, so having Aragon, yes, Gandalf, and then of course yes, Halbarad, archers, get all the rangers in one army. Cav, the wardens. Your orders, my lord. Unfortunately, some of these guys are going to have to remain in the reinforcing army and try to go for Barchelek and have a big fight over there. They do have trolls. Anyway, enough rambling. Let's see how we do. First, Anminas. Alright, we do have another potential general. You don't have a lot of stats, but you do have two stats that gives public order. 
Sure, I'll take you. You're quite young. And... What do you know? I have a mission to talk with doors yes, of Erebor anyway. And looks like they have Onazanar. To That's gonna be another... 750. Well, reasonable, so... Ah, was that actually Gimli here? Did not pay attention. Yeah, it is. Hey, nice. Uh, looks like Gondor at war with Enid White. Start bad. Of course, Atelier under siege. Venti didn't have enough movement speed to besiege Fuirost. Sure, Gobdain is gonna be a, get besieged. How is Barry? 70%. Perfect. 36. Uh, should be safe. Now, yes. I don't see. Angmar. Come and get me, you coward. Getting Be interested gone. here. Orders, my lord. I will only address you in uh, battle. I mean, I do have upgrades for the armor. I do have upgrades here as well. Yes, my lord. Right, I think we're gonna have go. a bit of chase with these armies. Come and get they can get until coward. there. I will only address you in battle. Be gone. So I think maybe I'll stop Halbarad in these trees over here in this small forest and then just... Your order, yeah. Lord. What I'm going to do, I'm just going to move troops out. I'm going to leave two slots free for Aragorn yes, and Gandalf. Orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. But the rest, I'm just going to organize the armies, like take the rangers that I want, move the troops that are going to get retrained and all that. In the meantime... Okay, finally finished with the paths. Beating the Leather Tanner in the Forest Terrain. I'm good with it. That's gonna be another 40 increase. I'll wrap up your head Although... and on your neck. I'm only here Ooh, to fight hold the up. Loot. Your orders, my lord. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I'll this wrap is. Up your head, my lord. I'm only here to fight the Yaga your will. Hmm. Okay. Might be a bit of change of plans a bit. Okay, this cave actually Orders. can't reach. Yes, my lord. It'll stick. Right. These guys as well. They did move some of the guys out, but I'm assuming they're like nearby. Your order, yeah, this is one thing. I'll wrap up your I head forgot. And spit on your neck. I don't need to leave a garrison for uh Honesterine. I thought for a second they took the Shire as well. But this is still the same. Yes, my lord. I'll wrap up your head and spit on your neck. I mean, I do have Cav. Your will, my lord. Orders. My lord. Your okay, will, definitely I'm gonna have to leave these lord. guys in. Will, yes. Unfortunately. My lord. Orders, and these guys can't orders, actually reach. Your will, my lord. Yes, my lord. How far can it go? Okay, your you cannot. On your, neck. your orders, my lord. Yes. Yeah, I'm gonna move something my like lord. this orders. for now. As you wish. Joining forces, my lord. Orders. We have rangers. I mean, if they have neck. only like militia tier. Yes, my lord. I'll wrap up your head and spread and your you orders, can actually stay into yes, the fort for now. Your will, my lord. Okay, let's see. Say command. I put two calves there and then the rest with Eldarion. Your orders, my lord. Orders. As you wish. At least to have the calf. Your will, my lord. My lord. Then these yes. guys as well towards we here. Yes, my lord. Now I'm gonna keep them on the on the bridge. My lord. Uh you know what? We can stay as at the Nozanar and try to see if we can get some cash. We have these guys at Seloniak. Start bad. Okay. Right. Uh, as I said, I'm gonna deal with these guys. Organize or screen yes, the army for Halbarad. 
Although, hmm. I will only address you. Your orders, my lord. It's a small issue. I need to make sure I am retraining. Yes, my so lord. So I can't exactly take everybody out properly. So I might need to leave the rangers inside. Your orders, my lord. Actually. Let me just move some of the yes, guys that lord. need retraining. Orders. And of course move some of the guys out of here. Sure. Your orders, my lord. Right, I'll, I'll, I'll see how I organize because I realized if I leave Novcha too undefended or too... Like really bad troops, then they can besiege Novcha. Another option would be like take everybody, like the generals, take them out, make sure they're with Halbarad. And I don't know, keep them outside. Not inside, because I, if I have a captain's army outside, they can Angmar can decide to besiege Novcha and then attack the captain's army or attack the captain's army, and I'll have Aragorn coming to his force months. But I would much rather have a captain's army coming to his force months from the settlement. And if they besiege the settlement and then they attack the yeah. open field army, at least yeah. I'll have yes. Aragorn yes. and all the rest. Hmm. Yeah, that that's how it's gonna be. Your orders, also, this lord. guy I could have left him in Dead Man's Dyke. Now that I think about it. Oh well. Your will, my lord. Right. Ah, uh, decisions, decisions, decisions. Okay. Looks like. Uh, I'm gonna stick well, you. is gonna attack me in a deal. My lord. You guys. Your will, my lord. Start moving Come towards on. that port. Master I'm gonna lose cash anyway, so it's not much I can do at this point. I will get some cash from these sally out battles. And again, I'll have to see where it's gonna get invested. Yeah, apparently, I can retrain the bodyguard here, sure. Okay, I'm gonna check that more off screen. Yes, my lord. And I'm not gonna say I'm gonna see you into the fight for Anuminas because I'm not sure what Eredluin has over here in terms of troops. Your orders, my lord. And yeah, this guy I should have moved them to Honesterine. Oh well, mistakes were made. Anyway, I'm gonna start with Angmar first and As then uh, do Ened White's Sally Battle. And I'll see you. The next time. Okay. Oh, wait. We have Mount Gundabad be sieged. Then, okay. Talk with Kingdom of Dale. More orders. What can I do for you? This I can do, but first, let me just talk with Gimli, Without and then we can. Uh, as you wish. I then I have. Continue tomorrow. Once I have like three turns. Potentially, I don't know. Uh. But yeah, maybe I'll talk with the door, the Dale afterwards. Right, I did decide to get the clan spearman just to have some extra units over here. I am being besieged. Novcha. Uh, I betrayed some of the wardens, and I believe. Was the militia? Or the arch militia? I can't remember. Don't have enough guys for uh, the rangers. Now, interesting enough, he's moving in. Well, actually, it did show there. It was the uh, Bilan Militia. Your I had enough, actually, to have a full stack of the best units. Well, minus one Warden, and then, of course, the Scouts that just been trained. Yes, my lord. And he is not attacking. The input on the siege and whatnot. So I'm thinking... Can I make uh, an escape with these guys? And I say have these guys help take Mangalan with the general that's here. 
Uh, why is the Nenad White army... No, they did not attack Bree. Okay. Uh, I'm getting attacked from the north. Now, also here... I'm only he moved... Here to fight the well, of course, I'm being besieged. Fui Rost. Host in a deal. Barry. He moved this single unit from I'll up here and neck. looks like he's retreating with these guys. Yes, my lord. I'm not seeing any other troops around here. Oh, and that Dwarven culture is going up rather quickly. Your orders, my lord. Fortunately, yes, I cannot reach with this general. Your orders, so I might have to keep him in there for now. Or actually yes, keep an eye out on them and like at least the uh, income is gonna be a bit more higher and whatnot Orders. then these guys can reach as by well my lord. Orders. Your will, my lord. other than that your will, my lord. Orders. oh are you Orders. serious i cannot reach with all the calf my lord i'm only here to fight the yaga loot if your i put Orders, it under siege lord. really Finally, here we train these guys. I should have them train Barry. Uh, no, without the militia. Apparently, I cannot get rangers here. Huh. Should I can deal with those guys? Why can't I reach with the calf? That's why. I... Ah, stick really. Your will, my lord. Hmm. That's not something I expected. Yeah, looks like I'm gonna actually raise. I won't have cash to upgrade it anyway, so I'm gonna leave it on high tax rate. Yeah, no. And by the time the herbalist finishes, I'll have enough population. Yes, my lord. I mean, if you think like this, I'll wrap up your head and spit on your neck. Unless he has like a bigger stack around here on the on the west, which I do not know. The obvious solution would be like to besiege it from the middle here. I do have some calf, but I'm a bit surprised I cannot reach with this calf directly. I'm only here to fight the huh. loot. Interesting. Your will, my lord. Order. And even if I move into the fort, I'll I still can't your reach. On your neck. Your will, my lord. Your will, my lord. Mm. Okay, those angels will, cannot move. I'm only here and these guys would have the enough movement speed to even intercept if I move uh, some troops. Your orders, my lord. You know what? We're gonna risk it With as honor, it is. As you command, we shall prevail. Yes. And hopefully, his troops are away. Yeah, these I'll guys can still reinforce, but neck. they're gonna get stuck into I'm zone of control. Yes, my lord. They cannot go into this corner. Then I guess. My lord. Orders. My lord. Uh, Orders. Your will, my lord. Sure, yes. have them into the fort because. Wrap up your head and spit on left, on your go on ballista, which means. Orders. My lord. My lord. The militia will be lord. useless. Orders. Um, the rest actually can stay like that. I'm only here to fight the Yaga loot. Right. And now here. I will only address you. Come and get me, you coward. Your will, my lord. Be gone. Looks like Come I can uh, run away. Yeah. Can have these guys actually we move towards the soul. Maybe a pit stop at the fort because they can't move farther than the fort. So they can reach it, Your and then have Aragorn with everybody here. Of course, I'm gonna need to retrain the scouts, but that's fine. And now I have a better army over here. 
in case I need to do Sally out and whatnot. Maybe he'll decide to either not attack or or organize all the troops and attack. That could happen as well. That's actually a doom stack over there as well. Please, these guys to upgrade. Okay, I'm gonna finish with the uh, general. And yeah, I'll have this army retrained. And I think it should be enough to take Mangalan. Yeah, they only have like three guys. One of them may be a better white, so that could cause a bit of trouble. And I could have these guys actually link up with this army. And maybe that's something. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to exterminate. So that's gonna be a lot of potential population loss. Right. Yes, my lord. So, depending what's gonna happen, I might see into the siege for Aluminas directly. I might skip the management entirely for the next turn. Do it off screen. Or if they have like a doom stack around here and hopefully they moved away, they had like one, two turns to get away. Hopefully they're not going to be able to reinforce from the west and the south. I'm hoping they're, I don't know, they decide to go after Enet White because they are at war. Tough, man, tough. But yeah, at least... Uh, Fingers crossed that he can manage to take Anuminas in under 5 turns, so I don't need to... ...to exterminate. And hopefully it has quite decent population, so I can push to upgrade it. But for now, yeah, I'm gonna start with Angmar here. I'm gonna give them off screen, and I'll see you either into the siege for Anuminas, or maybe on the campaign map. If I'm forced to retreat or something. Uh, yeah, either way, I'll see you in a couple seconds. Attack! Right. Well, I did say I'm gonna see you in the fight for Anminas, but uh just wanna point out how lucky I am. There's no attempts to defend, not even that bigger dwarven army. I don't know, maybe they moved here, they're in this fog of war. I don't know yes, where they are. Lord. But I did get to see how much population it has. Also, it's one of the custom generals. Uh, there's Nar. So they're around 1,600. So that's still 2,400 short. Uh, it's gonna be annoying. Right. At least it's still gonna grow a bit more quicker, actually. And since it's a city, I can leave it on a low tax rate and have the growth really go up. It looks like there's already chicken farming over there and some of the buildings. And since I'm gonna occupy, it's not gonna be. Well, it's not gonna be any losses on the buildings. Uh, in the meantime, I did already solve it all the sieges. Angmar did decide to siege me here. I just cleared them out uh, in a sally. Just finished with it. It's a long one. Strangely enough, it only he, they only attacked me with one stack. This stack, this guy over here was on the north side. He decided to retreat, to be there. Sure, whatever. In the meantime, this guy's in the fort. Next turn, probably. Let's stop to see with the rangers if he can uh, retrain. Uh, can retrain the scouts. I only need cash. Once they take a new minus and maybe destroy some of the buildings, who knows? More retard. Not enough cash to retrain here, unfortunately. Yeah, that's pretty much. Also, I got another adoption. Uh, it's this guy over here. Again, uh, decent stats for also honest public order quite a bit. I have decided yes, to move them towards Brunost at least, or maybe. Uh, how many can I have in Brunost? I believe just the two, right? Where's the... Yeah. Two. Yes, my this lord. guy, he can reach Brunost next turn, yes, but 
this guy is a bit slow, so maybe, you know what, he's gonna go towards the fourth. And maybe not exactly close to the fourth, because then goblins might be able to jump on him. Maybe stop around here at the bridge, and then next turn, move him there. And then, of course, this guy is at met rate, had to do a sally out battle. Get a bit more experience for this guy. Oh, Perfect, because once I take Mangalen, it's gonna be a bit more helpful. Right. That's just I wanted to point out. Yes. And if we besiege, he doesn't have the garrison. So he literally has the general, which still can do a lot of damage. The general of the Blue Mountains. Uh, he's a missile unit. Once I get melee hopefully uh, but this looks like it's gonna be a lot of units that on my side definitely the militia they're gonna be maybe all gone I'm gonna try to see how much damage I can do with my archers but yeah I'll see you on the battlefield Master your courage men all right, we're reaching down the gates, the about to go down, there it work. goes, and uh, looks like he's having his pikemen at the entrance, that's surprising, the general is way in the back, huh, okay, then I guess, we try the same tactic, and I have my ultra militia, Try to see if they can fire just through the gate. My general did actually fire a couple of shots at the start of the turn, so that's why we already have like 2% killed from their part. But yeah, let's see how much damage I can uh, do before I'm forced to push through. Yeah, knowing that they spread out. Oh, we're still hitting. I'm not uh, doing kills, unfortunately. guys as well just hold fire for a second oh hold up hold up hold up interesting he's coming out and oh looks like he's coming with the general as well all right I'm gonna say no though if he's coming out that's perfect because I can take advantage of uh... only half the enemy force remains okay that actually took most of my arrows out You know, I'll start focusing on their general. Why, guys? Why were you firing after the pikemen? Uh, you're going off. Okay, bad positioning on my part. With, uh, these guys. 
You continue running. Let's do the charger right there. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Good tidings. The enemy general nice. lies dead. There goes the, the general. Sacrificing quite a lot of cav out here. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Okay, we do a charge from this side. Behold how our yeah, continue back. I need to make sure they're victory. out. Okay. I mean, actually, it could have ended the battle because I'm doing the siege, so... Anyway, uh, lost quite a bit of cav. Played a bit... Mm -hmm. Too impatient towards the end. I uh, should have done just some charges with the cav, and that's about it. But hey, at least we got the Luminas. And... Yeah, I'll do the management and all that, see what buildings I have inside. If I can demolish some of them that maybe I don't need them at this point or something that I can't use at all. And I'll see you in the next turn. Okay. While I was uh, ending the turn, I was actually thinking if I'm going to have a situation uh, like I had in my campaign with Ered Luin, where I had a garrison in uh, Osgelon. And Northern and I did not even move any troops towards it. And I was thinking if it's gonna be the same with Anuminas, like the dwarves are not gonna attack Anuminas. But, uh, hmm. that might be a no. Unless they actually wanted to go after these guys, which I just moved into Anuminas to have a bit of reinforcements. Uh, but yeah, in the meantime, Barry under siege. Atelin, no sages at Novcha, and not sure Come where these guys want to go. I will they're not you bordering. Were they actually me. trying to go after Come these guys? I don't know. Right, in the meantime, realized that I had a calf in this stack, so that was an extra free upkeep because I moved them into a soul proper. Well, in the meantime, this guy's gonna hop over Order. there. Orders. Can I make lumberman? Or can I not make train? No, I cannot. Which Order. means... Actually, not even uh, woodland hunters. By Which your... means only rangers. By your command. Which I cannot. Uh, at least I'm not... Playing upkeep for them, and actually speaking of upkeep, Order. I can actually. Will, my lord. Was it four? E five. I can move one more. My lord, by your command. Okay, and that's gonna be free upkeep and all of those guys looks like I'm making some cash for now and I have more cash coming This guy's gonna be into the fort uh, I can't move the general yes, just no. yet towards Anuminas because I don't know if these guys Actually wanted to go after that Army stack that I had nearby or they want to go for Anuminas and if your orders, my I get the general lord. out, then yeah, they definitely can go after them. In the meantime, Q stalled. Uh, equipment import, right? Betraying over here. Sure, you can have the calf. And that's about it. Right. Yes, my lord. Keep. Your orders, my lord. I cannot reach. I'm gonna... Yes, uh, my how far can you go? 
Yes. Yeah, I'm gonna You're make a pit stop with this general right at the bridge to make sure I don't have you. any surprises. Because they might maybe some troops in the forest hidden. Right. Uh, this is under siege, sure. Can construction complete, only tier time enough for upgrade. I am gonna Hmm. I might get enough from the Sally out. I have one, two, three, four. Yeah. Also, actually, my lord, what I'm gonna talk with Dale. You hold make sure I get that 750. And then yes. next time, we're gonna try to speak with the dwarves. And now I can definitely manage around. So I can have the have tier time upgraded. Because I'm assuming we went for what, yeah. Rangers over here. And whatnot. So not paying up keep there, not paying up keep here. These guys they're only gonna be retrained at Metrate. Bangalan is still a rebel. Not sure what's going on here. Assuming they, yeah, Bree still has under towers. And here, ah, yeah, actually we're retraining here for armor. Yep, yeah, I'm fine by, by it. It's not a big investment, like 140. That's manageable. Although, ah, right. I need to make sure I get the. Uh, the walls, so I kind of need like 2,000 something. This is 900, uh, 2,300. Will I be able to get that much? I have to double check. Maybe actually don't retrain these guys. That's another 600 close to it that I can get. It's more of a tough for now, it hasn't been under stress. What about Novcha? All good. Right. Uh, already talked to the doors or Dale. It's gonna be next turn. I'm gonna try to see. Yeah. They still uh, not gonna give me anything. Certainly, up so slowly but surely, I'm getting the population. Also in the deal, trailing behind quite hard, unfortunately. If I have the ship farming, that will help quite a bit. Alright. Uh, sure, I'm gonna start with Angmar here and... Uh, then do a double check with the management, see if I can... Upgrade, have enough for upgrade for Tirthain. If not, maybe priority at least to repair the walls. I'll have to see what I can uh, mix and match around. Yeah, for now, As time to clear these guys and I'll see you in the next turn. Attack! Okay. We have more Nazgul return to Dol Guldur, and I think I just had a coming of age. The Vineyard's leader is dead, okay. Leaders in uh, Heroes, no. One good about besieged, Erebor besieged. Guess what? Mission to take Mangalan. Hmm. Perfect. Thank you, game. At least uh, you give me something interesting. Now, since I have to take Mangalan, I think. Should be more than enough. I'm gonna leave these rangers here with us also. Oh, I can retrain them at some point. No sieges at Anominas though. Had enough to repair and build the library, and then of course enough for the upgrade for Tirthine. And actually, apparently, I just had enough to retrain these guys here as well. Just 
barely I was left with one gold and looks like the one ring is in Dunard okay a metrate under siege uh, again the fourth under siege I'm assuming Tharbad at some point is gonna be under siege uh, looks like um, I didn't have enough actually cash apparently to have one warden to chain. I don't know why all of a sudden I got so many cash from the those guys. Okay, so I have the rangers here, so I do have a bit of cash I can play around if need be. And where are you? You're in Brynost. Um, physical attractive. A lot of public happiness, proper morals, uh, more or less all, all right, at least, mm, well Lord actually I am paying Lord. upkeep for him, so I guess you're gonna go yes, there, Lord. you as well, not paying upkeep, perfect. Now since Erebor is under siege, uh, this is annoying, because I Would cannot talk to with them. To me? Yes, my lord. Uh, I can't reach Bonazanar. I know Erebor has a fort somewhere, and I think maybe it's around Without question. Yes. this area. As you wish. Oh, there it is. What nice. You wish to talk about? Let's see. I'm uh, dejected for the moment. Yeah, I'll have enough cash to retrain and all of that. So yeah, no sieges here. Uh, I, they do have some phalanx. Actually, so this is a different army. This is the one that I thought maybe they're gonna be siege enemy us, but they're not. I'm only here to fight the loot. Is this? Also, I think I might be able to throw a tower. With honor. Yes. Yeah, I'm gonna. This tower will keep maybe the last cash that I have. Throw a tower over there. That's not exactly helping, right, because it's in the valley. Wonderful. Uh, but yeah, I wonder if they want to go for Barry or I'll this unit is going to besiege Anuminas because maybe they have more elite troops. Also, I did swap around the fort, what I had, so I have the cav here. I am going to move them now in Anuminas. Just in case they get any ideas. And then you can wish. move there, not paying upkeep. Perfect. My Your will, my lord. Uh, yes, I my lord. think actually I'm not paying upkeep in Deadman's Dyke with this guy. Yeah. My lord. I'm gonna do a swap command. around. It's gonna be a bit of increase in terms of income. And I'm not paying upkeep for the troops. Gonna have to relax a bit in Anuminas with Eldarian, unfortunately. So yeah. Also, I don't know what Angmar plans to do with these guys. Like seriously. I already have four guys over here. Yeah. Gonna. Hey, I keep unfortunately for these guys. I really hope they're not going for Osu. I'll be surprised. They shouldn't because they don't border Osu or anything. So I'm just assuming they were trying to go after these guys, after this army. So that's what I'm thinking about. Right, uh, I have these guys here trained. Maybe I'll just leave again the wooden hunters in Methrate just to retrain them and then move the rest towards Mangelen. I'm hoping Bree is not go, I'm gonna go for Mangelen. How many turns would it be? Actually, two turns. Mm, maybe actually one turn? Or I'll stop somewhere like really close. And it is a village, so I don't exactly need your own, yes, your own, yes, to keep it under siege. Yes, my lord. My lord. Orders. Your will, my lord. 
Looks like the, yeah, with the cap I can move. But yeah, it looks like it's gonna be like two turns anyway. Because maybe next turn get full moon speed, maybe up until here. Or maybe I can put it on stage closely. I don't know. Right. But for now, I think I'll leave yes, it here for this episode. I'm just gonna no. right, try with these guys. Your orders. And yeah, I'm gonna leave it here for this episode. I'm gonna see, of course, deal with the Sally out, see how much cash I'm gonna have afterwards. Then again, do management and all that. And I'm just curious to see, I might have actually a situation where they're not gonna go after Luminous, regardless how much garrison I have in there. The same way that Notre Dame and I didn't go for Osgelon while I played the Redwin. So, yeah, we'll see. For now, hopefully you enjoyed this episode, guys, and I'll see you next time. But as always, don't forget to take care.